Well, good morning, everybody. Good morning, fans. Good morning. And uh, today, once again, I'm going to help you with English class. Uh, today's our topic is greeting. Greeting, you say it. Greeting. 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 Greeting means welcoming someone with particular words or action. Greeting means welcoming someone with particular words or action. Greeting is livre dit salue. Salutation. Greeting means welcoming someone with particular words or action. So, we have here shaking. Shaking. Shaking hands and saying. Shaking hands like shaking hands and saying. Shaking hands and saying. Shaking pow and okay. Saying is this year. Diciendo. Shaking hands and saying. Shaking hands and saying. Shaking hands and saying. Now you say it. Shaking hands and saying. Once again. Shaking hands and saying. Now, we have some expressions we can use and when you're greeting some uh, people. Greetings, remember that greetings means welcoming someone with particular words or actions. Ou bali la bienvenue. C'est bienvenue bali kek lot moun ki vini. Ou bali bienvenue, eh bien, ou di sa greeting, salutation. Bien. Eh, how do you do? How do you do? Yeah. When you say fastest, you say, how do you do? 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 expression sa le ou pa kon moun na. When you, do, you don't know the person you meet, for the first time, you say, how do you do? That just mean uh, hello. Just mean hello. Ça signifie hello. Hello signifie salut en français. Hola en espagnol. How do you do? That uh, is, isn't a question. Is it is a question? It just mean hello. C'est pas une question, mais it signifie hello. How do you do? How do you do? C'est là où on rencontre maintenant pour la première fois au capable de dire How do you do? How do you do? How do you do? How do you do? Ça c'est pas une question mais c'est directement signifie Hello. OK? Now, we can see uh, young people when young people meet et jeunes ou les rencontrer. Yo capable utiliser l'autre façon pour yo saluer yon avec l'autre uh, when they meet they use give me five give me five give me five give me five pa give me five give me five OK give me five ça c'est jeune monde qui capable utiliser give me five young people say that Young people say that. Young people say that. Give me five. 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 Seulement jeune qui utilise. Give me five. 
Okay? Say it now. Give me five. No! Give me five. Okay? So we have other expression in formal way you can use. We use this every single day to greet people. To greet people, we use good. In the morning, now Martin, in the morning, you say good morning. Good morning, class. Good morning, mister. Good morning, father. Good morning, dad. Good morning, cousin. Good morning, neighborhood. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. We say good morning. Good morning. Say it now, you. Good morning. You can say it correctly. Good morning. Good, 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 good morning. Morning. Good morning. Good morning. That you said this expression in the morning. But in the afternoon, you say good afternoon. Good afternoon. In the afternoon, you say good afternoon. Good afternoon. In the afternoon. Aquia means good afternoon. Good afternoon. Now you say it. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, class. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, mom. Good afternoon, dad. Good afternoon, mister. Good afternoon. 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 Good af good after. Good after. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good morning. Good morning. Good afternoon. Okay? Now in the evening. In the evening you say good evening. Good if good evening. 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 Good evening, Mom. Good evening, mister. Good evening, mistress. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Good evening, okay? Good evening. And the night, when you leave, when you leave, Leo Pabisha, ou pa kon kontwe moun nan anko, pou moman, li la nuit, ou kapab di, Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Night. Good night. Good night. Now, fasters, you say good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. So you use every single word, particularly or separately. You say good morning. That's it. In the morning. In the afternoon. Good afternoon. That's it. In the evening, you say good evening. But at night. At night, you say good night. So you leave the person and you go and sleep home and other any other place you, you arrive. So but you uh, won't see that person again. So you say good night. Right, you got it. Congratulations. So we have other expression we can use in this situation. And from our way, and they use this expression a lot in English uh, conversation. You say, How are you? 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 How are you, teacher? How are you, Sir Elmore? How are you? How are you, mom? But you can say in the other way, Fluent English use this expression instead of these. Instead of how are you, they say, how are you doing? They put something doing. This is gerund of do. Okay? They say, how are you doing? How are you doing? How are you doing today? How are you doing tonight? How are you doing this morning? How are you doing at this afternoon? How are you doing tonight? How are you doing this evening? How are you doing? How are you doing? How are you doing? How are you doing, Fasters? How are you doing? Okay, how are you? Or how are you doing? So this is for great to great person. If you are a great person, 
every single day you can use this expression that, do, that will be uh, great for you and a lot of expression more and at the next class I'm going to help you uh, to say them you, you say informal way hi you can say hi or hello or the next question hi okay hi guys for example every youtuber used to say hi guys and they speak creole they say hi guys and they speak creole that's a wrong thing you can use only english when you speak english when you speak creole you use creole only but if you are trying to to teach other person to help other person to speak English to uh, teach them and help them learning English you can use Creole or French other language the native language to help them understand okay you help them and their understanding and you use both languages but when you speak you use only the language you are using or you are speaking uh, at, at that moment okay so you say Hi! Hi guys! Hi my friend! Hi! Okay, you can say hi! Or you can say hello! You just say hello! Hello! Okay? Hello! But in formal way you say hi! But if you say hello and the phone you say hello! Uh, you can say hello and you, you start speaking too! And although you use in the informal way, informal way, eh, you say what's up, okay? What's up? Right? You say what? What's up? Okay, a comma here. What's up? What's up? What's up, man? What's up? You say what's up? Just you say you. What's up? Say it now. What's up? And when you leave the person you meet after you hear it, and you want to leave him or bless him or keep the person out of the pleased to meet you pleased to meet you or you can say glad too you can say glad to meet you okay you can say pleased to meet you or you say glad to see you right to the is for today of our past uh, let's have a, a, an assume here. Greeting means welcoming someone with particular words or action. It affects things you need to know. And then shaking hands, shaking hands is just like this. And say this uh, end of and this Okay, and this in French. And this in Espanol. Diciendo, oye, wabdi, pendant wabdi, en creole, how do you do? How do you do? How do you do? Ça signifie hello, ok? Ça c'est pas une question, mais c'est comme si vous t'es qu'à dit hi, vous t'es qu'à dit hello, ok? Salut, how do you do? Ou capable d'utiliser ça, c'est de rencontrer personne. Maintenant, pour première fois, c'est pour nous qui on est déjà dans la première fois rencontré. How do you do? Ok? And you can say genio, you utilize it. Give me five. Give me five. When they say that, yo, wow, give me five. Okay? Give me five. Say give me, give me five. You people say that. Okay? You people say that. And a uh, from away, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. And when you leave the person, and you say good night, okay? And you leave. How are you? How are you? How are you doing? How are you doing? And here you say hi in formal way, hello, or what's up in formal way. And when you uh, gonna leave the person, you say pleased to meet you, glad to meet you. Okay, that's it for today and next class. See you, the, see you again. Bye! English class.